Once upon a time, near the town of Bremen, there lived a poor old donkey. He was worn out and weary from long years of faithful service. His mean old master, realizing that the donkey's working days were over, decided to dig a hole. thought the donkey. What will I do for a living? I have it. I'll go to the big city and become a great musician. Hee-haw, hee-haw, hee-haw. With a toss of his head and a wag of his tail, off he went down the road. It wasn't long before he came upon an old dog, crying his eyes out. What is your trouble? asked the donkey. In my younger days, said the dog, I was a great hunter. I would dash into the woods and hunt with the best of them. But now my master has turned me out because I am old and feeble. My good friend, said the donkey, why not come with me to the big city where we will become great musicians? With a toss of their heads and a wag of their tails, off they went together. What is wrong with you? They asked. Alas, said the cat, I'm too old to catch mice, so my mistress tried to drown me. Come with us to the big city, said the donkey, and we will become great musicians. So with a toss of their heads and a wag of their tails, off they went together. <laughs> You have a lovely voice, said the donkey. You'd better join us. We're going to the big city to become great musicians. So with a toss of their heads and a wag of their tails, off they went together. Who are these strange characters that come stealing through the night? Why, they're robbers, returning home with their loot. What have they in that sack? It's moving. It seems to be alive. It's the goose that lays the golden eggs. Lay. Lay. Lay.
that's the way the story was told. But if the same story were told today, here is what might happen. The robbers would return with the golden goose. They would enter their den. Cautiously, the musicians would approach the window and... <laughs> Bremen Town Musician! 